8 Ways to Quit Masturbation for Good How to Stop a Masturbation Addiction Masturbation is a relatively common activity. It can help to reduce stress, burn calories, and promote relaxation. At the same time, masturbation can also become unhealthy if it starts to interfere with your relationships, work or school life, or home responsibilities. Fortunately, there are some things you can do to control your urge to masturbate so you can focus on more important things in your life. You want to quit masturbation for good because it's harmful to you. If you're ready to quit, work on changing your habits. Additionally, replace masturbation with a distraction activity. As you do this, try to build a healthy mindset about your desire to masturbate. How do one quit masturbation for good? Do subscribe if you are yet to do so, do give a thumbs up, leave a comment, share with friends and loved ones so they benefit as you are about to. Now 8 ways to quit masturbation for good. 1. Avoid pornography. Exposure to pornography may trigger the desire to masturbate. People who want to stop masturbating should avoid pornographic movies, images, and websites. If a person can place a barrier between themselves and pornography, it can help them break the habit. It is now very easy to access pornography in just a few seconds. However, people can try to limit their access to pornography by using filters on electronic devices that block certain types of content, such as pornographic material. Although a person can unblock such websites, Taking the time to do so can give them time to regain control of their impulses and allow the urge to pass. 2. Stay active. It can be helpful for a person to find ways to occupy their time that does not trigger the desire to masturbate. Finding outlets for energy release can replace the time spent masturbating. People can consider taking up a new hobby or learning a new skill, such as learning a musical instrument or trying a new sport. Developing new goals can help a person refocus their energy and find excitement and fulfillment in other things. It may also be helpful to determine when the urge to masturbate is highest and plan other activities for that time. 3. Limit the time you spend alone. Being alone and bored can be a common trigger for excess masturbation. Most people masturbate when alone, rather than around others. So if they want to decrease the likelihood of masturbating, then being around others more and not isolating would be helpful to counter boredom and lack of social connection. Think about activities you typically do alone that can instead be done with others. If you like to watch sports, try catching a game at the stadium or in a sports bar rather than from your living room. Binging a new show, host a watch party and invite people over. 4. Be patient with yourself. You didn't start compulsively masturbating all at once so the solution won't come immediately either. Be patient with the process of behavioral change. And don't add to any unnecessary guilt or shame about your masturbation habits by beating yourself up if you hit stumbling blocks along the way. 5. Regular exercise. Regular exercising can keep you mentally strong. Simple exercises such as running, swimming, walking and jogging can increase positivity and keep your focus straight. It beats stress levels and keeps your head calm. Simple exercises for 30 minutes every day will do you good. Exercise is a multi-purpose activity, notably known for its physical health benefits. Exercise also improves mental health. The release of endorphins reduces pain and tension while producing a calming effect. Dopamine is also released, which elevates your mood. Exercise can help distract and release tension from urges to masturbate. Over time, you may also feel and look better, which boosts your self-confidence. 6. Meditate. Meditation is an extremely powerful activity and has numerous evidence-based benefits. Its ability to nurture the mind-body-spirit pathway is profound, and it can prove helpful in stopping masturbation as well. Focusing on something positive such as a mantra or happy thought while taking intentionally deep breaths can redirect your thoughts. During this time, urges may subside. Once done, it becomes easier to focus on something else. 7. Speak with a professional. With most any issue, speaking with a professional in that specific domain is best. In this case, speaking with a counselor or addiction specialist is a great start. Licensed professional therapists are bound by HIPAA to protect confidentiality, with certain limits, and have worked with others who have similar issues. They have the knowledge. Experience and tools to help you work through the problem. It is likely that there are internalized challenges with negative thoughts and emotions such as anxiety, depression, and shame. These are natural and can be helped. 8. Think about the negative effects. 
One way to distract yourself is to remind yourself of or visualize the possible negative effects of excessive masturbation such as impaired sexual function, depression, dissatisfaction in relationships, high blood pressure, and swollen and painful prostate. Excessive vibrator use in women may result in side effects such as genital numbness, irritation, or cuts or tears. Identify the personal negative consequences of your habit of masturbating. This list might include things like difficulty completing work or school tasks and disruption in personal relationships. That would be all for now. Thank you for watching and staying to the very end. See you next time. Until then, remain blessed.